Hi, good morning. We're talking to internet specialist Zvi Lando today. Hi, Zvi. How are you? Okay. Hi. How are you? Very well, thank you. Zvi, what does SEO mean, and what benefits does it give me? Okay, a SEO is a search engine optimization. Uh, most of us have heard about this, but the uh, they don't really understand it. In fact, I've written a two-page Word uh, document explaining the basics. Um, the search engines, in, in short, the search engines want to be able to give relevant uh, uh, information to the people that use them, whether it's Bing or Google or whatever. Uh, if they, if you write Jerusalem uh, house rentals. They want you to get to the companies that rent houses in Jerusalem. They don't want you to get to some guy uh, who's selling something something in the United States, but he's put in Jerusalem ha ha a, a house rentals in his uh, keywords. And uh, uh, for that, uh, they are checking out all the time, the, the big companies, all the time manually, they're going from web website to website to make sure that web builders use uh, uh, the, only the type of uh, things that the search engines allow. There are companies called uh, SEO companies, and what they usually do is they promise, they, first of all, they promise you the world. Uh, second, they take from you a lot of money. And third, what they do to get you those results is they cheat a, they cheat the, the search engines to think that you're much bigger than you really are. They do that in, in, in all sorts of ways by landing pages and making multiple sites and, and things like that. I want everybody to understand, this is not allowed by Google or by Microsoft, and if they find you, you're blacklisted, and your website will never be on their search engine again. There, on saying that, there are things that the search engine companies tell us, web builders, what we can do, and it's something that I do for free in my, in my services because it's not a lot of work, but it, you really have to do it the correct way, and then if anybody contacts me, I'll send them the, the document that I wrote, and it explains. Zvi, tell me a little bit about the services that you do offer. We, we're, we're building websites, uh, the web projects, uh, whether small, you know, uh, one th even one-page uh, websites uh, like I did for my son for his gardening business, uh, or uh, the organizational websites, or uh, websites that are built by databases which allow people to edit and add as much uh, information as they want, pictures and things like this. Uh, we do programming, the graphic, the graphics work. Uh, I should actually say that the first thing we do is we help plan out the website correctly with the, with our clients, uh, which saves a lot of headaches and heartaches afterwards. And the, and then, like I said, we do the graphics, all the graphics work, whether it's flash and animation or whether it's just regular graphics, the design. And the, the web building, and of course the search engine optimization, which we give as a free service for our, uh, our clients. So you're able to work with large organizations or just an individual that's uh, starting up their own business. They can come to you, and you can try and customize and work together with them for something that suits their budget. Is that possible? Yeah, correct. Uh, we're, I can tell you that right now. We're working on a very big real estate project, a very big, it's actually a portal for the Haradi market in Israel. It's a very specialized portal, and it's a very big project. And at the same time, we're working with people who, you know, want a very, very basic website, and just to put their name out there. And we treat them both as Sorry, technology is changing all the time. How can we best keep up to date with all these changes? Well, first of all, I've always 
uh, I always stay focused, okay, I'm able to, was, was always able to look at the technology and see which ones are really important or which ones are just buzzwords and they're just trying to make a lot of money before people find out that they're no good. A, and I don't, when, when my clients come to them, a lot of my clients will say, oh, we want this and this and this and this. And I say to them, wait a second. When you start out, you know, I know that you, no, who, no matter who you are, your budget is, is, is an issue. And there are sometimes things that you can do uh, more inexpensively or things that you can do without in the beginning. And I always try and make the, the client, uh, I say to them, you have to be able to profit from your website, whether you're looking for money or you're looking for people or you're looking for organization, whatever it is, you have to be able to get some kind of a profit out of what you're doing. And I don't allow people to do more than that. Thank you, Svi. Thank you so much for talking to me today. Okay. Thanks a lot, John.